My name is Xia Dongdong. I'm a born sports fan. According to mom and dad, it might be because on the day I was born, good news was announced and held across China. Beijing. Making Beijing the first host city for both summer and winter Olympic games. I'm six years old now. I can feel the Beijing 2022 games getting closer day by day. Today, I have an assignment on the games. Can you guess what it is? Sustainability for the future is the vision of the Beijing 2022 Games. By sustainable, we mean protecting our planet and its resources, and meeting the needs of the present without compromising the future. All is to help the world become more beautiful, for cities to develop better and people to be happier. Do you understand? Yes. Okay, let's do a hands-on project. Try to build your version of a Winter Games Dreamland. Remember to use the methods for protecting the Earth that we've talked about today. Here we go. The teacher told us that the competition venues of the Beijing 2022 Games use some eco-friendly and low-carbon technologies, including carbon dioxide refrigeration technology. What's magical about carbon dioxide? Is that it evaporates at a low temperature and takes heat away with it, so it can be used to freeze water into ice without damaging the ozone layer or increasing greenhouse gas emissions that are bad for the Earth. This magical technology is applied to five ice rinks in four Olympic ice venues. Some of the Beijing 2022 venues. Are part of the legacy of the Beijing 2008 Games. Take the water cube where Mom and I often go swimming, for example. It has been repurposed into the ice cube. It will host the curling and wheelchair curling events in 2022. After the games, we can not only swim, but also skate here throughout the year. Isn't that amazing? Besides reusing old venues, the Beijing 2022 Games has breathed the new life into an old steel plant. Hey, in Shougang Park, a permanent ski and snowboard jumping site has been completed and put into use. Next to it are some silos used to store raw materials. Now, after some renovation work, they have become the office area for Beijing 2022. Over a century old, this corner of iron and steel has become a new landmark in the city. Now the Beijing Zone is down. It's time to build the Alpine Skiing Course in the Yanqing Zone. The teacher said that before building began, the construction workers took care to gather the topsoil containing plant seeds and stored them in a proper way. After construction was completed, the soil was returned and restored. In this way, a beautiful subalpine meadow has been restored, and the Alpine Skiing Center on the high mountains. In addition, people have come up with many ideas to protect the plants and animals in the competition zone. Thanks to these efforts, near the competition zone. You can find plenty of wild flowers and grass. The animals and plants continue to flourish in their original home. Zhengjiakou is another competition zone of the games. It takes less than one hour to get there by high-speed railway. The intercity travel is faster. There are more and more vehicles powered by clean energy, including fuel cell electric vehicles and hydrogen vehicles. They can help reduce carbon emissions, cutting down on environmental pollution. As the final touch, 
Let's light up the Olympic venues with natural wind and light. With some awesome technologies, different kinds of renewable energy are gathered in Zhangjiakou, converted to green power and delivered to all games venues, as well as numerous households in Beijing and Zhangjiakou. All these have contributed to staging a carbon neutral games. Of course, the Winter Games Dreamland should be a place for fun. The interesting winter sports have enriched our life in many ways. For example, traveling, training, competition, and work. By engaging in winter sports, we make new friends and live a better life. This is my version of the Winter Games Dreamland. Every endeavor you make will help make the games greener and the future brighter. The passion, joy, and wisdom derived from the Olympic Winter Games will nurture and shape every one of us and accompany us on the way to a better future. <laughs>